In men's health, local specialists are using advanced technology on a dangerous but treatable type of cancer. Detection of prostate cancer most often starts with a visit to a general practitioner. For most patients undergoing prostate cancer screening, it's a simple blood test as well as an exam. Today, with the advent of PSA, we have the opportunity to detect prostate cancer early. I went for a, a simple blood test that shows the PSA, and uh, my PSA was 65.4, which uh, it's not supposed to be above four. I wasn't even aware of what the PSA test was, and uh, it was just part of a general checkup that I did. And it, it had been a couple years since I did a checkup, and it was fine. So it, it had gone from nothing to, to the 65 over a couple of years. Stephen Burnett of Tavares went to Advent Health Waterman Urologist Jason Gerbach. He felt that it was very aggressive and that uh, we needed to uh, follow up with the, uh, the, the biopsy. Quickly followed up by MRIs and CAT scans. And uh, the good news was that it had not metastasized to any other organs other than the prostate. Dr. Gerbach referred Brunette to Advent Health Waterman's radiation oncologist, Anud Jain. His big plan always was to do the uh, first five weeks of uh, radiation therapy followed by um, the brachytherapy. And the brachytherapy is a surgical effort of inserting uh, radioactive seeds for uh, just a few hours. That plan worked out really well. Uh, the external radiation can deliver a dose to a broader area including uh, lymph nodes, um, or seminal vesicles, whereas the high-dose rate brachytherapy gives an extra dose specifically to the prostate gland. High-dose rate brachytherapy has the advantage of being a temporary implant, uh, so there's no permanent seeds uh, implanted in the patient. With the temporary implants, we can modify where the radiation is given off and have tighter control over the dose, so there's less dose to the bladder, uh, the rectum, and other sensitive structures in the pelvis. So the first follow-up after the uh, brachytherapy was uh, a, another blood test, and that blood test showed the PSA as non-detectable. Burnett says he chose Advent Health Waterman for his treatment after consulting with cancer institutes in Orlando, Gainesville, and even Jacksonville. Dr. Jane really came across as, as the most personable as to these are the pluses and the minuses of, of the alternatives. I mean, he, he definitely had a plan in mind, and, and that's the plan we followed. I can't imagine any place being, being any better. This, this was uh, definitely convenient. Find out more about the advanced cancer treatment options available locally by visiting adventhealthcancerwaterman.com.